Elon Musk asks every person he interviews one question. Here's the question. Tell me about some of the most difficult problems you worked on and how you solved them. And in that question, Elon can tell something very important. Is this someone who's being led by their inner hero? Or is it someone who's giving in to their inner victim? And great engineers are like great detectives. If you watch a great detective show, you'll see that the detective never gives up. The detective doesn't solve the problem in two minutes. The detective keeps working on it, keeps trying to put all these pieces together, interviews one person after another. On the way to solving the big crime, the detective solves all these little things, faces all these setbacks, and overcomes them. That's the way detectives are, great detectives are, and that's how great engineers are. Great, great engineers work on a problem without giving up for months or years. And if somebody can realistically talk about that, Elon knows that person is being led by that person's inner hero. On the other hand, there are other engineers that are just as educated, but they're being led by their inner victim. So they'll work on a problem for a short amount of time, enough to show the world that they tried, right? To show the world that they're a good person, they're nice, they actually tried, and then go into that victim mantra. Somebody help me, rescue me, save me, I can't do this. Somebody else tell me what to do. Now, when facing a hard problem, it, the, the hero engineers don't know how to solve the problem either, right? Of course, their temptation is also to say, somebody else help me, rescue me, save me. But what makes them great engineers is that they keep persevering. They keep working away at that problem from every possible angle over weeks, months, years, however long it takes, and eventually they figure, out, figure it out. And yes, they will collaborate with other people, but there's a big difference between collaborating and saying, I give up, somebody help me, save me, rescue me. Whether you're applying to an elite job like at Tesla or SpaceX, whether you're applying to an elite college like MIT, or whether you're working to get a top 1% SAT score, you're going to need to make sure you're being led by that inner hero and not giving in to that inner victim.